Hey everyone, Jiggles McMahon Puss here, and today we're gonna be looking at. Um, actually, actually, well, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. I, I um, I just gotta do something real quick. Fucking machete, making me look like an idiot. Yeah. Yeah, fuck you, machete. Yeah! Jiggles McMahon Puss here, and today we're gonna be looking at Coyote Reflex Power Armor. Yep, that's right, more armor, guys. Uh, this was suggested by Shivers1999 and Loco14, I believe it is. Yes, it is 14. Ha, I got it right, Loco. Loco14. Um, yeah, his name is in Roman numerals, and last time I got it wrong. Alright, so, Coyote Reflex Power Armor is here in Freeside, and, um, let's go put this little, this little suit on. Basically what this does, it just gives you a ton of nice little, um, extra points. Um, see, we got plus 20 AP, Enhanced Reflexes, Agility plus 3, and then the, uh, Cap... A cap. The visor gives us enhanced vision, critical chance increase by 5, and perception 2. Okay, so there's uh, configurations for the suit, which is pretty sweet. Uh, I haven't looked at these all at all, so let's go take a look. Um, visor configuration. Enable enhanced vision or return to main menu. Let's do that. Enhanced vision active. Whoa, now it's nighttime and I can see anything. It's pretty sweet. Um, I just want to do something really quick. Let's turn this baby off. Sable. Now it turns off. Um, a few of you mentioned uh, from the last video, the Gunrunners one, um, that when you buy a you buy ammo here, it actually does drop in here, which um, technically it makes sense, but I, I just really was not expecting that, and I thought it was pretty funny that I missed it. All right, so let's take a look at this baby. Um, so yeah, this is a really, really beautiful model. I know I always say that, but I'm gonna say it again. Um, I think the texture is really what adds to this one, though. Um, texture is really, really well done. I don't know. Some of... It's a good amount of detail without going overboard, so... I mean, if you have a slower computer, I think this armor mod would run pretty smoothly without, um, going after any of your, uh, memory too much. It seems like it's... Pretty, um, pretty soft on processing power. And it doesn't seem to be very high poly or anything, so I mean, it looks beautiful and uh, doesn't have a lot of polygons, it looks like. At least to me, it doesn't. But, um, I mean, the texture takes over for that, so it looks fine. So let's go see what we can do with this baby. Okay, so let's take a look at the other uh, configuration, suit configuration. I've enabled these uh, reflexes. Um, so normally, you would just be, you know, going pretty normal speed. But this suit can, um, you can see I'm running considerably amount higher, not higher, uh, faster. And I can really get some air too. Look at me. I don't even care. I'm going to jump through the air, because I don't even care. Hey, what's up, robots? Thank you for visiting new things. Oh, shut your robot mouth. Let's do this. Let me uh, turn off the menu. Ooh, now I feel like I'm playing a uh, third-person game. That's crazy. Um, I did take, um, just a qu another quick note about something else. I did take a suggestion of getting the centered third-person camera mod. So... Thank you for that. I should post the um, link to that in case anyone wants that. So I'll be doing that. So back to the suit. You can run a lot, lot quicker. And I'm pretty sure that doesn't really take away anything. Got to turn menus back on. I mean, like, it uh, doesn't require any necessary energy cells or anything. 
So let's see what this upgrade stuff. Suit is as of yet incomplete. Perform the necessary mod modifications at your nearest convenience so as to ensure your condition continuous survival. Thermoptic cloaking. Suit overdrive. Do I just blow up? Ah. Material from American Stealth Boy cloaking systems can be interlaced between the ceramic armor plates and made to interface with the suit computer with the application of ingenuity, a little elbow grease, and around three dozen electron charge packs. Material required. Two out of four Stealth Boys. Zero out of one conductor. Sensor modules. So you got four out of three. Electron charge pack. You got that right, but you need more Stealth Boys and you need more conductors. Oh. And I'm just going to look at the other one. You don't know. All right, I'm gonna get those materials and I'll be back. Hey everyone, so I'm here at Sunset Sarsaparilla Factory and we're gonna be doing this thing. That's right. We're gonna go invis invis invisible. Jesus Christ, we're going invisible. Thermoptic cloaking. Note added. Thermoptic camouflage. Notes. Notes. System dump. Thermoptic camouflage integrated successfully. Operation is as simple as selecting cloaking from the main armor menu, then proceeding stealthily towards your target. While cloaking is active, AP will be consumed until it becomes depleted, whereupon you will become visible. Cat, so keep that in mind, man. Just watch out, man. Let's go sneak up on some people. Let's do this. Activate cloaking. I'm invincible and I look like a chicken. I'm invincible and I look like a chicken. Look at my little legs moving like a chicken. My AP is not going down at all. Look at my tiny legs, I'm a chicken. Look at my tiny legs, cause I'm a chicken. Look at my tiny legs, because I'm a chicken. I'm never gonna stop singing because I can't find enemies. Mm, here, I found them, never mind. My AP is finally going down. I have a melee weapon, but I'm not good at melee. Oh, look at my legs. They look like chicken legs. Say what? Mm -hmm. Chicken legs, chicken legs, chicken legs. Chicken legs are here to stay. I looked at you and you said no way. I said chicken legs. Mm -hmm. Chicken legs, mm -hmm. chicken legs, mm hmm. Chicken legs, mm -hmm. so For some reason, I can't attack this bitch. Better hurry up. Yo, what's up, chicken legs? I take all your clothes. You don't even know. <laughs> Just got killed by a chicken, bitch. Holy shit. A lot of AP just went away. So, that was my cloaking. It only took a year for me to get over here. Oh, that's a guy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Pumpernickel. And let's try out this other thing. Ooh, what's over there? Alright, so now we have all our supplies for our wonderful, wonderful little tiny overload thing. Um, just one thing I want to mention that I, I don't know why it's just happening, but for some reason... My uh, radar, you can see down there on the bottom left, it says there's an enemy. Oh wait, now it's working. Okay, I took my armor off and, I can see, now it's detecting people behind me. But there's no one over here. And it says there's two people over here, which there are, but... I don't know, for some reason the radar things are kind of weird. And the AP isn't going up. And, um, I, I changed the armor too, to just something different. Like, uh, field stuff. And then my AP totally goes away, which is really weird. So, I don't know if this is because of the armor mod or something, but... Um, I hope it isn't. Even though, um, it seems like it is because it only happened when I turn on the mod. So, unfortunately, I'm pretty sure that the mod is doing this. Also, apparently these red scorpions don't give a crap anymore. I'm not cloaked. Why doesn't this guy care? Alright. 
This is very, very weird. Suit overdrive. Oh. Okay. Alright, suit overdrive. Overdrive, your, your suit is extremely dangerous. It will damage the suit's integrity, dump ac excess radiation onto the nearby ambient environment, and ta tax your body to the extreme. However, while it is active, you should be able to dodge bullets and drive your fist through the person firing at you. People around you will seem to slow to a crawl while your entire body will seem to vibrate with energy and the most strenuous physical exercise will seem trivial. Or at least that's what we got out of the last crippled, mostly brain dead test subject. Oh, wow. Activation will require an overdrive charge and, and will run off your AP. Once your AP is depleted, the overdrive will abruptly terminate, likely throwing you off your feet and leaving you at the mercy of your foes. Keep an eye on your AP at all times. Okay, well, considering my AP is not working, this will be perfect. So let's go turn this baby on. Guessing this is like bullet time mod. I'm not bullet time mode. Uh, suit overdrive can severely affect both suit integrity and musk musk goes uh, whatever. Blah. Oh, fuck you. I don't have enough AP and it's not coming back, asshole. And look, these little bleeps disappeared again. This is great. Now there's one. There's one there, and he disappeared. And all right, this is great. Um, I'm just doing mods that do not work for me lately. Apparently, apparently I'm just a giant asshole who can't get mods to work. Um, all right, I'll be right. I'll be back. I'll try to get my AP up. Where you going, Mr. Bighorn? Where you going? Why are you fighting him with your fists, lady? Mr. Bighorn, you're so big, why don't you just fight him? Okay, I get it. You're an idiot. Once again, I've saved the day. No need to thank me. Feeling thirsty? I can take care of that. Well, uh, that's pretty disgusting. Bitch. Alright, everyone, so it's been an entire day, and, um, I still cannot get my, um... I can't get this to work. Um... Oh, damn it. Well... My AP still just doesn't go up. I don't know, I don't understand why it doesn't. Um, 152 out of 132. Um, that makes no sense whatsoever. Uh, let's see. Let, let me see. Again. I'll be right back again. Alright, so I did a quick adjustment. We got all the upgrades now. And, bam, bam, bam. Suit configuration. Oh, let's activate the overdrive. Warning, you're a dumbass. Okay. Oh, I can't do it. Great. Um, I don't understand why this isn't working. My AP should just come on right away. Just go up there. But for some reason, it's not. I really don't understand why. So, I'm just going to go and have some fun. You guys want to join me? I think you do. Let's go have some fun, shall we? Let's. Also, forgot to mention, um, this is the Combine Sniper Rifle. Um... I don't know what this is from, unless it's from Half-Life 2. Um, this is requested by no one. Just, uh, it was actually in the Coyote Reflex demo video. Um, kind of cool. I don't understand why that little blue light is there. Um, I know in Half-Life, the sniper rifles did have a blue light. But this seems to serve no purpose, since it stops after about 2 feet, or 3 feet, or 4 feet. So, I like the gun, don't like the blue light. No need for it to be in there. So, let's go have some fun.